Global warming is the latest in a long, almost never-ending series of crusades. I've forgotten how many millions of dollars he's made out of this. The first, the first column I ever wrote more than 30 years ago was titled The Prophets of Doom, P-R-O-F-I-T-S, of Doom. And so the same, it's the same phenomenon uh, today. I mean, there is, there is money in this stuff. You have to pretend to be certain, because otherwise you'll get no support for what you're doing. I mean, you go around saying, well, I, I think there'll be global warming. Well, that, that, there's no money in that. <laughs> I mean, there's no votes in that. I mean, what, what you know, exactly. I, I just talked to God, and he told me that it's going to be global warming. Now, let's set up a multi-billion dollar program to stop it. So many places where they've had record low temperatures. They had snow in Houston, the earliest they've ever had. Uh, the, 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 last, the last last record for something like this was like five inches. They got 20 inches. I mean, every, and what used to amuse me a lot in recent years is when they had to uh, schedule a global warming conference and they have to cancel it because of the cold. You know, I mean, it's just, but it, does, it just doesn't make a dent. Imagine if you're an assistant professor uh, in, uh, in meteorology or climatology, uh, and uh, you, you, you think that global warming is a crock, and, and the full professors who are going to vote on your tenure and whatnot uh, are getting millions of dollars in grants. I mean, how eager are you going to be to burst into print and saying it's all nonsense?